organic buildup was a real problem into the market and we needed to find a solution for that. Well, the need for the non-marking anti-static tire is coming from the users itself. There are operations in which uh, there is a lot of uh, static electricity developed. Those are loading in the vehicles through the operations and there is an issue if there is a static discharge. Sparks can lead to electrical failure on the forklift truck, injuries to the forklift truck operator. Sparks can lead to even fires. Actually, this pro project started very slowly years ago but very intensively for, uh, for the past year. We did a lot of uh, listening to customers. We went into the market, uh, we went to factories that were using non-marking uh, tires that were telling us about their problems. The big challenge uh, in front of us was to find the right material to improve conductivity while maintaining the same physical properties of the compound. You could see easily dozens of people uh, just laying over a tire, trying to figure out how can we insert a strip of black rubber into a white tire. Uh, actually, we uh, built a, a series of the product, prototypes, but unfortunately, uh, uh, several prototypes failed. That uh, the tire was not performing as we wanted. It was not. Uh, it was curing with bubbles. There was uh, plenty of different uh, difficulties we have to overcome. As a compound development team, the biggest challenge we got is to remain the conductivity as initial. That is the first one. And the second one is the trade wearing. During the year, I can tell you we have uh, found uh, plenty of ways how not to make a good tire. Uh, in, the, in the manufacturing floor, it's not easy because it makes your life diffi uh, more difficult. At a certain point of the project, we were very, we were wondering if this was going to be feasible. The prototype process to build the anti-static is where all of the teamwork came to life. Without the teamwork, this is not possible to achieve. No? Then, uh, as a one team, we all got together. This is not only one man show. This is our strength as a Sri Lankan chemists, engineers factory floor workers, all of those people came together and ultimately delivered the solution. To the team that worked on this project, uh, I just want to say how proud I am of them. That's all.